Mm-hmm. Oh, it's morning. Good morning, Sparky. Oh, good morning, Existy. It's nice that you let me live here temporarily. I've been thinking about it last night. But, to be honest, well, I've got a question. Why do I need to sleep on the floor? Well, I mean, I only have three things in my house, remember? I can't just buy a bed. All I have is my not bed, a manky tissue, and a copy of Minecraft. Okay, stop that. Fine, let me get ready for whatever we're gonna do today. Unfortunately, there isn't time for that. Why? He's here. Wait, what do you mean? Hello, it's me, the art critic. Remember me? And I'm here to reveal the votes that people cast last episode so that one of you two could win this, these brilliant prizes that are definitely worth it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I forgot about that. So, let no further ado. Let's go to the place where art votes are revealed. Yeah. So yeah, welcome here. Wow, I like these podiums. Fancy. Last time, people voted on your bold and brash pieces of artwork. Wait, where did you even end up putting them anyway? Uh. belong now. So do you need a glass case in the Natural History Museum? Uh, yeah, let's let's just say that. Anyway, let's just get this over with. We got 13 votes. To be honest, that's more than I ever expected. Oh, wait, but Mr. Art Critic, isn't 13 an unlucky number? Well, yeah, it is. But so are you, because you only got five votes. Spooky, you win because you got eight. Oh my god! Thank you, everyone! Now I thought I'd win. Spooky, here are your prizes. Nice! Wait, but why did he win and not me? Oh, well, that's a simple explanation. The majority of people voted Spooky because of all the mustaches dotted around his drawing. What? What? But I sabotaged Spooky with them, and they were the reason he won? Yes. No way! I actually won the trophy and the five luxurious English pounds! Yes, you did. Uh, also, I have no more plot relevance, so, uh... Ah! Oh, I can't wait to spend the five pounds! Uh, where are we gonna spend it? Oh, at a five pound land, of course! Oh, I've never been. Well, I haven't been in a long time, but I do remember all the prices of five pounds. We're bound to find something good. Uh, well, how do we get there? We're gonna have to walk. Oh, well, it's simple. Just go left, and then north, and go back on yourself at south, and you'll see a playground, and a swing, you swing on the swing, turn east, you'll see a cat eating pizza, and once you do the Oompa Loompa dance next to... We're here! But what about the playground, and the pizza cat, and the Oompa Loompa dance, and the big- Oh, I lied. Oh, great. So, how about we enter the shop? Eh, that would be a start. Wow, well, this shop is abnormally large. I agree, it's like a maze in here. So, where do you want to go first? Well, I mean, it's your five pounds, so you can decide. Ah, oh, how thoughtful of you. Let's go to the self-care section. Alright then. Look, there's a lot of stuff here. Uh, not really. Whatever, does it look like you want anything from here? Uh, oh, oh, look, a bed. I was talking about I wanted one earlier. Oh yeah, I remember now. Wee! <laughs> Ouch, it hurts. Aw, oh well, I thought it was the perfect thing. Looks like I can't get this unless I want the back pains. Well, is there anything else here you want? Not really, they don't look too interesting. Uh, well, how about we look in the sweet section instead? That sounds nice. Let's go there. Okay, I thought there'd actually be something here in the sweet section. I'm sorry, Spooky, yeah, there's just nothing here. Oh, I remember this bit. You just have to wait for it. Wait until... Ah! 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 Wow! Oh, wow! Wow, that was unexpected. Yeah! They're all the same thing! I 
got six of the same thing. How unlucky is that? Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, great. Now what? Hmm. Oh, I know. I just call the local bounty hunter. What? What? Bounty hunter? Why are you calling a bounty hunter? This is no time for a bounty hunter. Why do you even need it? Let me call it. <coughs> Wabble, babble, stop it, tabble, cobble, bonk. Stop, you're gonna get yourself killed. Ah, oh, hi there, bounty hunter. I need you to do something private for me, if that's okay. I'll just whisper in your ear right now. I am whispering in your ear right now. Got that? Okay, good. Now, go do your thing. Okay, what was that about? Why did you call a bounty hunter? Why? Oh, you'll see. I need answers. You'll get them in shortly, in about like... You'll get them in about five seconds, really. Ugh, I have bad feelings about this. Hunter. Nice, you're back. And you did it. You got the bounty. Oh, oh I get it. Bounty Hunter is in like bounty. It's in like chocolate and because it's, it's like bounty. Oh, yeah, oh, I'm a genius. I'll oh, figure it out. Okay, uh, let me just pay you for this, you for your efforts. Because, I mean, these are all the same. And I wanted some variety. And you definitely delivered. I love coconut. So I'm just going to grab my five pounds just over here. Okay, and I've got my five pounds and I'm ready to pay you, okay? Is five pounds enough? Okay, good. Let me just talk to Existy for a second, okay? Okay, bounty hunter, I'm back. You ate it? You ate the bounty? Why would you do that? I get that you can get hungry sometimes, but that was my bounty. Are you sure you can't find any others? Oh, you ate the only bounty. Uh, this is the day has been really unlucky. Sure, I did win, but so far the only thing we found is a really dumb shop which sells beds that are too lumpy because it has bumps all over it, and a sweet section with no variety. Uh, this day has been pretty bad so far. Uh, like, where are you going? Ah, uh, now we're just left with half a bounty. Uh, oh, what do we do now? We could try one last section of the shop. Okay, what would that be? Uh, I don't know, I would like a companion. But I'm your companion. Yeah, but like, I mean like a pet, you know? Man's best friend? Alright then, we can see in the pet section then. Okay, let's go. Third time's a charm. I'm sorry, Spooky, things haven't worked out. Oh, look! A pet! Oh, yeah! Oh, oh, no, I know what that is. That is the Chlorillus monscronculus. Why do you know so many complex words? Oh, I don't. I just like making things up. Well, it does make sense. What actually is that? I'm not actually quite sure. I would ask somebody around the shop, but they seem a bit busy. Oh, but it looks really cute. I think you should stand back. It looks like it has big teeth. Hey, I don't need a book by its cover. It could be really nice. Yeah, I think we could pay for this. Wait, no, it's just you don't. Ah, it grabbed the five pounds. What? Hey, come back here. That's mine. Ah, oh, wait up. Come back, come back, come on. Okay, we're here. Oh. Oh no. Oh, hi there. Hi, Art Critic. Hey, you said you had no more plot relevance. Oh, hi guys. And also I lied. I don't- I still have plot relevance. I'm not gone forever. 
Oh. Great. Well, we have a little situation on our hands here, Mr. Art Critic, and I think we need your help. Oh, well, I mean... Why? Why do you need help? What's the situation? Well, Spooky's prize, the five of Jory's hundred pounds, got taken by this monster here, and now we're trying to chase it around, and we need a diversion that can, so it can grab something else, so we can take the five pounds back. Hmm, a diversion? Well, you should try one of my delectable, really nice, really good lemons from my company. Nobody can resist them. Available. No, see, look, observe as, as this plant is flawless, I shall give it the lemon. There you go. See if this works. Go eat the lemon. Hey, hey, no, lemon, you come back here. Curse you, monster. Ah, oh, by the way, the lemons, they're five pounds. I'm coming for you, lemon. Ah. What just happened? I think the lemons were so repulsive that as soon as the monster took one sniff of them, he jumped off the edge and threw the five pounds, and then the art critic also jumped off. Oh. Well, at least we got them back. <sighs> well, at least we do have them back, but there's nothing to spend them on. We've looked everywhere. Well, it must be a pretty small shop then. Uh, oh, I feel pretty sad right now because I can't find anything to spend my five pounds um, that I really want. Oh, don't worry, Spooky. Hmm. Oh, I know one more place where we can find something that you can buy. I think he accepts five pounds. Who? I'll tell you. Okay, so. He's outside of the shop. You know the dark alleyway next to this five pound land shop? Yeah? Well, I'm pretty sure he lives in there now. Who? Well, I think his name is Shifty. He sells stuff that I don't think he can find anywhere else. So it's an illegal shop? Basically. But it's the last hope, since I guess this is the only shop around for miles. Uh, I guess so. This is our last try, though. Okay, there's got to be something good in there. Let's go into the dark, deep alleyway. You know, I thought you said this alleyway was deep and dark. It's short and very light. Ah, uh, uh, well, I, I, you see, I have an invisible torch. Ah, invisible torch, of course. Why didn't I think of that? Look, we're nearly there. I mean, he's nice and friendly. So, yeah, I mean, I know his name is, like... You can judge his name a lot, because his name is literally Shifty, what are you going to expect from him? But, you know, I think he's going to be good. Nice. Uh, Exister, you're going the wrong way. Uh, oh, sorry, I, I couldn't see where I was going. Hmm, so your invisible torch, huh? Right, we're nearly there. Is that Shifty? Yeah, I think it is. What? What? Uh, what are you two doing here? Uh, we're wondering if we could buy something from your shop. Listen, you shouldn't be here. I can sell things that you don't want to be caught having. You you really shouldn't be here. Well, please, we've been looking all over and we want to spend our five pounds. Where is it? Uh, Spooky, where is it? Uh, I've got it. Oh, okay. He's got it. Well, uh, I still can't let you in here. It, it's pretty illegal. And, yeah, we need to keep our voices down, otherwise someone might spot us. Um, oh. We're committing tax evasion right now. He's teaching me. Yeah, yeah, he's right. Oh, uh, okay. I couldn't let you fellow criminals in for just a little bit, but that's it, okay? Okay, then let's go in. Wow, look at all of this illegal stuff. Look at his toilet paper stash. It goes up to the heavens. Look, the plastic straw. I thought these were illegal. Well, I mean, they are. This is why he's selling them. Oh, look. It's a baby version of that monster we saw earlier. Ah, oh, it's a bit angry as well. Wow. Wow. I wonder what we can buy. Hey, hey, Shifty. Can we buy that? 
But how much does any of these things cost over here? Uh, well, the toilet paper, uh, they cost 20 pounds. 20 pounds? Yeah, each. Each? Yeah, um, looks like you can't afford that. Oh, what about this plastic straw down here? Well, that, um, I'm afraid you cannot get that either. That one's 500 pounds, because they're very popular in demand, because paper straws suck. Uh, uh, tell me about it. Uh, the only thing that you can afford is this, uh, ancient artifact, yes. Uh, yeah, ain't, this is the ancient artifact. Yep. And, uh, it doesn't normally, it normally costs a million pounds, but just for you, it's gonna cost five pounds. Smokey, did you hear that? We can buy something from here. So, do you wanna buy the ancient artifact? Yes, please. Yeah, I'd love to. Here is your five pounds, my good sir. Ah, uh, thank you. Thank you for that. You can have your ancient artifact. Well, thank you. Existy, look. We got something in the end. And it's an ancient artifact. Wow. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Shifty Man. Oh, uh, yeah, don't mention it. Let's go. Whee. All right, thanks. <laughs> wow. I can't believe they fell for that. It's a penny. <laughs> Trading five pounds for a penny, who would have thought? <laughs> wow, today really was successful. I agree. Let's just get past your door. <sighs> home sweet home. Yeah, especially for me. I mean, sure, you've only lived here for one and a half days, but. I'm glad you like it. <sighs> Ooh, after all that day, I'm tired. I just want to go to bed. Yeah, me too. Okay, come on. Okay. Good night, Spooky. Good night. Yeah. Uh, uh, what a nice day. Oh, congratulations on winning, by the way. Thank you. Good night.